Hi, everyone. Welcome to our November lunch meeting for La Sociedad. We're going to get started right now. Uh, before we do, make sure that you put your student ID in the chat. A lot of people have been forgetting to do this. Um, and remember, if you forget, then we won't be able to give you credit. So make sure that you do this right now. Just put the six digits. You don't have to put your name or any extra text. Since we do have 56 participants currently, we hope that we'll have around the same number of student IDs that are inputted. I'll give you guys a few more seconds and then we will move on to quiz time. So for that, you can just put A, B, C, or D whenever you think you have the right answer. All right, ¿Cuándo es el Acción de Gracias este año? If you think you have the right answer, you can just put it in the chat. Good, the answer is D or D. El Día de Acción de Gracias es en el 26 de noviembre en 2020. We are still doing Operation Smile. You can earn hours making greeting cards for Operation Smile patients in Spanish. Uh, just make them high quality work and 10 cards is an hour. So um, for those of you who have been doing the Operation Smile cards, or if you signed up to do Lentils of Love last year, but you weren't able to drop them off due to COVID, um, we are having a pickup. So this will be on this Friday, November 20th, from 4 to 5 p.m. in the pavilion near the Riverstone Clubhouse. Um, the directions are on our website, but you have to sign up for a time slot um, due to COVID, um, COVID guidelines. And for this um, semester, the Lunches of Love drop-off is only for those of you who we gave hours to last year. But if, if so, if you don't, if we gave you hours last year and you don't bring those bags, you'll be penalized that amount of hours for this year. And please make sure you put your bags in groups of 25 so that we can count them and validate your hours quickly. Um, in addition, if you won a medal last year for the MSC during 2020, you may pick up that medal. So the link to the sign up for the slot and further instructions for the Operation Smile cards are on our website. So the National Spanish Exam Registration is open. Um, the sign up form is on our website. And it's free of charge for SHH members, so all of you guys. And if you took it previously, you have to take a higher level this year. You can earn up to three SHH volunteer hours for your practice at home and completion of the exam. And we will provide you practice resources. So, can, oh, my bad. So, continuing on, additional hours can be earned for the next school year. So, if you get an award and um, you're gonna have additional hours in addition to the three hours that you already get for practice. So um, you can get four for ORA, three for PLATA and so on. And you need to make sure that you take um, the exam that is either your level or higher to qualify for the hours. The AP review sessions opportunity is still going on. Um, each session will have uh, two to three teachers and you can also teach through a friend. So, you know, that'd be a little more, uh, more fun. And if you've taken the exam and are interested in teaching a session, go ahead and fill out the form located on our website. And if you're interested in attending a session, we'll post more details over winter break. All right, so thanks to everyone who applied for the tutoring stuff. Emails have already been sent out, so make sure that you check your inbox. And we would like to open this opportunity up to anyone who wasn't able to fill that application out in time. So we've extended the due date to November 22nd. So you have a few more days to get that done. And we've also simplified the application. So it's not as much work. Make sure that you check it out. Uh, a lot of the Colombian students have requested for tutors who are comfortable with speaking Spanish. So this is a great opportunity for you to practice your Spanish in like a no judgment environment. And if you're interested, make sure to fill out the application on our website. As we said before, it's really short. Um, it's nothing too tedious. And the due date is extended to uh, November 22nd. For the second mile in food bank opportunities, it is in person. So if, you, um, if you're harmed by this, 
It's not our fault, sorry. You can earn a maximum of two hours per type and the link is on our website. So our giveaway opportunity is still going on and um, winners will be chosen on December 1st. So you still have plenty of time to follow us on Instagram or Twitter or repost anything we post on Twitter or Instagram for additional entries. Quiz time number two. Donde y cuando será la entrega slash recogida para los, las bolsas de almuerzo las cartas y las medallas. So if you think you have the answer, just unmute yourself or put it in the chat. I think it's B. Yep, B is correct. So the Drop off and pick up, that'll be at the Riverstone Clubhouse in, or it'll be at the pavilion near the Riverstone Clubhouse on November 20th, which is this Friday from 4 to 5 p.m. And make sure that you look on our website for more details as well as the sign up. We'll open a few more slots for the sign up since I know we have had people say that they weren't able to sign up for the times that they needed. And before you go, make sure that you put your student ID in the chat once more privately to the host, that's me. And just the six digits, once you've done that, you guys are free to go. See you guys soon. Our next meeting will be December 2nd and 3rd. Have a good day. Um, can I ask a question about the hours for the National Spanish exam? Yeah, sure, go ahead. If we register for the National Spanish exam and study this semester, do those hours go towards this semester or do they go towards next semester? For Spanish Honor Society, our hours count by the year. So oh, okay, yeah, we okay. don't separate them by semesters, right? Okay, thank you. Yep, no problem.